Daedalus and Icarus, a story from Greece. Look and listen. Maze. Prisoner. Port. Wings. Feather. Frame. Wet. Melt. Drown. Float. Let's watch. Daedalus and Icarus, a story from Greece. In ancient Greece, there lived a very talented architect called Daedalus. He built a wonderful maze in the palace of King Minos of Crete. King Minos kept a minotaur, which was half human and half bull, in the maze. When Theseus, a prince from Athens, killed the minotaur and took the king's daughter away, King Minos was very angry. He blamed Daedalus and kept him and his son Icarus as prisoners on the island of Crete. Daedalus could not leave the island by ship because the king's men guarded the port. He tried to think of another way to leave. Then, one day as he was looking up at the sky, he had an idea. He could build huge wings and fly like a bird. So that's what he did. He gathered together feathers and built some wooden frames. He stuck the feathers on the frames with wax. Soon, he and his son Icarus were ready to fly away from their prison forever. Remember, said Daedalus to his son, don't fly very low or very high. If you fly too low, the sea water will wet your feathers and weigh you down. If you fly too high, the hot sun will melt your wings. Once in the air, Icarus loved the feeling of flying and forgot his father's wise advice. He went higher and higher into the sky, enjoying his freedom, sure that nothing could happen to him. But soon, the heat of the sun melted the wax and the feathers started to drop off the wings one by one. Daedalus was too far away to help his son. Poor Icarus fell into the sea and drowned. And all that was left was some feathers floating on the water. Daedalus was heartbroken when he lost his only son. He named the nearest island Icaria in his memory. And from that day on, he did not try to fly ever again.